Yo, monkey, it's me, DDP, the king of Bada Bing, the master of the diamond cutter, the three-time, three-time, three-time world champion and founder and CEO of DDP Yoga. Okay, grab some water. We're about to wake this motherfucker up. <laughs> The inspiration for DDP Yoga was necessity. I'm a guy who wouldn't be caught dead doing yoga the first 42 years of my life. But I didn't start wrestling until I was 35. My career did not take off until I was 40. So I was constantly searching for ways to hold back the hands of time. 96 was when my career took off. 97, 98, I was on top of the world. Then bang, I blew my back out so badly that three different back specialists said my wrestling career was over. But when it was suggested that I might try yoga to heal my body, I gotta be honest with you. I was like, yoga? A guy wouldn't be caught dead doing yoga. But at this point, I would try anything. And in less than three months, with what would become DDP Yoga, I was back in the ring. I'd proven the doctors wrong. And at 43 years young, I was my first time of being awarded the heavyweight championship of the world. What on it means to Diamond Dallas Page is being just that, on it, on the top of my game, being, giving people and giving my entertainment performance its top level. And as someone who is actually the guinea pig of DDP Yoga, it's important that I can do some of these extreme things at 57 years young. And when I'm hitting that and holding that, you know, that position with my leg over my head and having a conversation with somebody, I am totally on it. The reason why I'm a big Hemp Force fan, first of all, is taste. Because <laughs> if it don't taste good, I'm not eating or drinking it. And I know that the hemp seed as a protein product is way better than, say, a whey, which to me is at the bottom, because that's also milk too, and genetically <laughs> changed milk. I'm all about feeding people real food for what, like our great-great-grandparents. I mean, that's what organic really means. <laughs> Way back, you know, 60 years, 70 years ago, that's how people ate. There wasn't all these pesticides and preservatives and the changing of the genetic structure of food. It didn't exist. Today it does, and most people are eating garbage. So your body is only hitting its certain level of what it can actually really do because you're putting garbage in it. When you put real food in, your body will heal itself. And you, well you, you better get on it or you will feel the bang, monkey.